Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is T. Today I'm going to do a short video on seven random brands that you may have never heard of. If you have, great. Let me know uh, how you like them and um, share with me anything new that you've tried as well. Without further ado, let's get started. So the first item I have for you guys is an um, oil roller. It's called Baccarat Rouge 540. This is how the bottle looks like. And uh, this is a 10 ml bottle, you guys. It is a roller ball, so it's very easy to apply. You know, you can apply wherever you want. You can throw in your purse because it's so small. You don't have to worry about it leaking because of the the type of bottle and for 10 ml it's gonna last you a lot especially if you're somebody like me who doesn't use a lot of perfumes and this is perfect for me the scent also lasts forever and if you haven't tried this it's kind of masculine but it's feminine at the same time i can't really describe it and this is perfect for holiday season where you want to give small gifts to friends or family for inexpensively and the site has dupes for everything. You gotta check it out. And this is, uh, I love this website and this is the first one I bought, but I definitely not the last one I'm gonna buy from them. And I think it's about $25 per container, which is very reasonable. You can get free shipping during certain time. You can get 10, 15% off. Depend on, you know, if you're a first time buyer or they have specials and all things like that. So it's worth checking out. So here it is again. So the next two items I have are from a website called Beauty Beautylish. I'm gonna link below for you guys as well. The brand is called Good Molecules and I got two items from that same brand. The first item is Hyaluronic Acid Serum. And here's how the body looks like. Is you get about 30 ml in that, which is, you know, generous. Um, I, I got this for $6, you guys, and I figure I want to try something new and it's uh, non-toxic, which is this supposed to be. And if I don't like it or if it doesn't work, I can always give to somebody else or throw it away, basically. So I tried this on. It's very, um, it's not watery, but it's not super viscous. I'll, I'll let you see it. So, and it's clear. It feels like water on you basically, but it spreads very well and it's kind of cool on your skin, which I love. And it gives you additional moisture for sure. And this is something I definitely need for the winter when your my skin is a little drier. So you can see, I mean, it's not sticky at all. And I really enjoy it so far. And from what I read on the website, it's very similar to Inkly brand from Sephora for similar price range. But if you want to try something different, um, I would give it a try. I really like it so far. Uh, I mean, it does give you a slight glow to your skin. The item, another item from the same brand is a soap, a bar soap actually for your face. See how cute the design is? Sorry, I used it because I got so excited. So I used it first before I did the review, but it, this is uh, only $6. Uh, I think the other one might be $8. This one's only $6, very inexpensive, you guys, but it is amazing. It lathers really well. It uh, washes your skin very well, no stingy at all. You know, it's, it's no irritation. It's, um, I think it's a dupe for Drunk Elephant because I do have the two soaps by Drunk Elephants, the exfoliation kind and the regular kind, the white soap. This one, very, very similar to it. And it has no scent. I mean, not at all to me. And I love the color. And I, I would definitely check it out. Uh, the next item I have for you is random very random is called drops it's actually a laundry um item a laundry pot i i guess you can call it a pot so my husband got this uh, a while ago actually uh it comes in in a box uh, a box like this it's got two parts they are amazing you guys you got to back check it out it has a really nice scent and i can describe i think it's supposed to be a lavender actually it is lavender and eucalyptus um and environmentally friendly uh minimal package see how small this is it is smaller than your thai pot powerful powerful uh, let me tell you i use this as laundry detergent um 
fabric softener because it smells so good at the end so i don't use fabric softener anymore and it is powerful for a minimum size i only use one of these and for a large i do use two and your clothes come out smell really good like you actually put fabric softener in them and i just love these you guys and i think i got a coupon for 25 dollars off we've had this for a while see this is how they look we've had these for a while but um i think i'm gonna have to replace them but i haven't even opened the other side of it by the way it's called drops i don't know if you can see it like everything else i'm gonna link them in the description box below highly highly recommend this item another item i found is called it's a cleanser and this is my latest obsession it's called one love organics so you might be familiar with that already but this is kind of new for me uh, I got this from Credo store in San Diego. Um, I think they have another store in San Francisco. Recently, they closed the one in San Diego due to COVID. But they do have the website. And I think you can get free shipping for, I think, if you spend a certain amount of dollars. And But anyway, this is called Enzyme Cleansing Oil with uh, Botanical Vitamin B. First time using it, amazing, you guys. It only has 120 ml in it. Or, uh, or four floor, uh, four ounces. Honestly, I feel like I can use this as uh, without having to do the second cleanse or first cleanse before this one. Um, the way I check it is I after I wash my face with this, and I don't usually wear heavy makeup. I do wear makeup every day, and uh, even with sunscreen, I feel like it cleans really well afterwards, and I don't have to. Um, I really don't have to do a second cleansing and the way I check it is I use magnified lens and look in every nook and corners of my face and see if there's any trace of it. Sometimes I use, um, I think, a face wipe to see if it shows on my sheets and it barely shows anything. So on the days I wear light makeup, I use this, I wash this only one time and it's, the texture is really nice. It's, it's oil, but it's not oily at all. You can tell this oil, it, it washes everything, makeup, mascaras, everything well. And it smells like uh, pineapple. Love, love, love this. Hi guys, I'm back. Uh, I just went and put on some lipstick because I feel like I, I look really washed out. So the next item I have for you is also, it's a soap actually, also from uh, Credo. It's called Soapley for Credo, and this is how it looks like. Um, I think I pay about $10 for this, and I know don't be worried about the um, precipitation on the bottom. This is an amazing soap, you guys. Uh, you never think about soap the same way again. Um, there's 10 bucks. This is a glass container. It's really cute before it's precipitated but i don't mind it because it's so amazing it's so moisturizing it cleanses really well um it has little to no scent and i just had to try it out the review is amazing and you get about eight ounces for um for the soap which is not bad for something super clean a credo uh only carries clean products so you know you still feel safe uh purchasing stuff from there um you have to try it out for 10 bucks give it a try but here here it is again it's called this is more than soap and i agree 100 percent okay so the last item i have is a foundation by uh it's stored by the store called credo and the foundation is called axa um the description is high fidelity semi satin foundation on me though, by itself, it gives me glass-like skin, especially if I apply it with my fingers, and I love the look of it. Uh, for something quite sheer, I mean, not, not sheer in, in coverage, but sheer in application, it has medium coverage. I have a lot of pigmentation on my cheeks, and I, I feel like it covers really well. Um, the color I have here is KB350. I am light, medium olive mostly, but I think it's a little dark in the winter for me. So I, I think I'm just going to use that in the summer. But it smells, um, it has little smell. I don't know if you can tell the color right here. It has very little smell and it spreads so easily. You I would compare that with um, Ilia foundation, if you're familiar with that. Uh, that's also sold at Credo 
Sephora and a lot of stores, also a clean foundation. But I think I like this better because it does have more of a glass skin like and it's not as transportable. It's only $38 compared to the other one. The other one is a little more expensive. And for $38, you get 33 ml, which is more than you typically get. I think the typically size for a foundation is about 30 ml. It comes in a, a container like this. It's, it's a pump and it's got a, an, another cap over it. So you're, you know, it's a very cute container actually to me. And if you don't know what to get, if you order online, because they really don't have a lot of stores, you, you can order something from their website and get the sample card. And the sample card comes with like 20 different samples. So it's really easy for you to pick out the color that you want. So I would check it out. Any case, I think that's all I have for today. Uh, if you like this kind of content or like the, this video specifically, uh, hit the like button below and subscribe to my channel. I, I hope to see you in the next video. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.